Fallen were cool. Don't know why I was reading that out loud. Probably one of the weird things you do when you're just kind of exhausted. That dungeon really took a lot out of me. High level bandit enemies sometimes give me trouble. That's why I honestly kind of have Lydia. It's just kind of like a fodder right. enemy. But everything we should be good. We should be able to get this achievement finally. I work so You've more than proven that the Thieves Guild is back on its feet in our city and earned every bit of your reward. Tell Delvin that he can count on me to provide the influence around here with the right people when he needs it. If you're ever looking to sell any illegally obtained merchandise, I'd also provide my services as a fence. It's the least I can do. Trinkets are today. How much do you have? Four thousand. Ooh. Especially as tempting as that would be to sell to him, gonna hold on to that for just a little bit longer. Speak to a brand new elf about becoming the guild master. This should be the final thing. Oh. Let me. I want to get rid of some stuff. So what I'm going to do is, uh, well, I guess we can go to the general store in Riften. But I am essentially full on a bunch of crap, so I'm going to get rid of some stuff. And there's a dragon. I hear him. Please don't come fight me. I don't want to deal with you. You dick. Go away, please. Go away. Go away. I don't want to deal with you right now. I just want to put the thief skill behind me. Fly away, please. Thank you. God, what is with Riften and having a shitload of dragons nearby? General store is... Where? Oh, right, I destroyed that. Welcome to the pond. Or a bit of this and a bit of that. Okay, uh, you have 700.
Can I sell on my ring? I still have my uh, ring on Mara. I think I accidentally sold that ring somewhere. I wasn't didn't mean to, but oh well. That should get me pretty low, yeah. I should be able to have the uh, thing now. I somehow, at some point, uh, sold my ring of Mara. Uh, my wedding ring, which actually gave a pretty decent re restoration effect. But that was a mistake. I don't know where or when I sold it, but I no longer have that now. My friend, the time's come to make it official. It's time to become our guild master. Don't worry, I promise this will be short and sweet. If you'll just meet us in the center of this cistern room, we can begin. Proceed to the center of the cistern. Really? Oh my god, I'm even Blackfire is here. That's funny. Why is. I guess even Blackfire is connected to Thieves Skill, but it still seems weird to see her here. Look, I've never been good at these things. I'm just gonna keep before we do that let me go ahead and put on my thieves armor sure being guild master means more than just getting a cut of all the loot it's about being a leader and keeping this rabble in order with that in mind I propose that the position of Guildmaster should be yours. Delvin? Agreed. Sure, why not? Carlia. Absolutely. Everyone is in agreement. So all I can do now is name you Guildmaster and wish you good fortune and long life. Now, everyone, get back to work. So, if you need anything, anything at all, don't hesitate to ask. Well, that's it. Sorry if it isn't the ceremony you were hoping for, but we're not exactly known for throwing our coin around. After we're done, head over to Tunelia. She'll set you up with your guild master armor. Oh, and one last thing. Here, I want you to take this. It's sort of a tradition around here. God. Oh, what? Was I crazy or was I... I didn't have this in my inventory, did I? Am I just completely blind?
That's interesting. Uh, I guess I didn't sell my ring of matrimony. Here's to a long and prosperous future. May the guild last another hundred years. Yes, and I'm more than happy to give it to you. I mean, look at this place. I've never seen so much wealth down here. You've made us all rich. Here you go. Should fit you like a glove, boss. Usual guild rates. Let's take a look at Oh, achievement. One with the shadows. Finally, I got it. So let's see what the difference is. We have like three sets of guild armor. We'll never use these. Wow. 50 points compared to... That doesn't have effect. Thirty-five points, so that's already better. Hypothesis of success is thirty-five percent in comparison to fifteen percent. So it seems like the only effects I will be comparing it to is uh, the regular guild guild gloves. A guild set. So lock picking is thirty five percent. Lock picking is fifteen percent. So this looks like it's a uh, twenty five percent increase, maybe. No, that doesn't make any sense with prices. Prices are twenty percent better. Prices are ten percent better. Me. Let's see how we look with this on. I mean, it looks standard, but like brand new off, honestly. But the Thieves Guild is now done. No reason to be here. I actually want to do some inventory management. I also want to dismant, uh, disenchant some of my things. Be I'm just, uh, I also want to store my gear a little bit. Oh, before we do, okay, so I think that the guild uh, tribute chest uh, offers the same way as uh, your wife's being uh, paid, where. Uh, or wife shop where randomly over time you will get some more progress for uh we'll get some more progress for uh what's called uh you will be, uh, be able to collect profits i guess is what i'm trying to say I have a lot of money to spend, so how about 1,000 gold? Huh? Seriously? No way! With this, I, I could buy everything in the market! I spoil my kids way too much. Yes, my love? What do you need? Right there... Is it in... Oh, look, let me first do this. There's also a really easy way to uh, 
level up your enchantment. Okay, so that got me a little bit lower. I also want, I think I have mannequins downstairs, maybe. another thing down here you know I just had another mannequin no I don't it just doesn't look like I do okay Maybe it's in one of my other houses that I have it. This is through here, no. Wait, I guess one I had like a bunch of mannequins. I think it's on one of my other player houses. The only thing I really care about The only thing of this that I really care about, carrying capacity is okay. I can already uh, carry a lot. But what I want is prices for sure. I want to keep my Nightingale armor. Deep skilled armor I can store. Actually, we'll go ahead for Guildmaster as well. Actually, what am I doing? I was gonna... I forgot why I was doing that. I was gonna put that armor on a stand somewhere. But I don't think there is a... Uh thing here. I'm thinking if I were to give a best guess, it's possible that the thing that has the armor stands may be the house over in Dawnstar. Maybe. Oh, we'll check here first. Dawnstar is a house that I never actually finished. So I just kind of stopped. It would honestly help if I had armor on. It would honestly help if I had armor on. I'm actually going to try and disarm her. Soon, 
it's just kind of like a random event that can happen where bandits will attack your um it's i assume that it's common to happen in uh this house in particular because out in the boonies And Bandit Marauder. Come on. There we go. I want to take another look at that Bandit Chief. I think she died over here. Never mind. Oh, hello. Apparel. We'll put on the Guildmaster stuff, and I'm gonna keep the hood. Okay. Yeah, it is here. All right, apparel. There we go. So we are done here. That has got rid of almost a hundred stuff. A little bit. Grab a hundred. Let us now head over to Balathor. And we'll also pick up Lydia while we're here. So basically I'm just going to be doing the sale glitch and just uh, to get rid of all the stuff I don't want. That'll get me uh, quite a bit of money. It probably won't put push me to one hundred thousand, but it should push me close. While I stop by to pick up Lydia, I will also go to uh, my home and see if there is anything uh, that I want to sell for my chest. But uh, this is the last thing I'm gonna be doing on the stream, most likely. Just getting ready a bunch of crap I don't need. What's funny, I think I've done like maybe 30-ish live streams of this game. And I still remember things that I did on my very first playthrough of this. Uh, it's something I could dismantle. I don't need Ebony Bow.
This ain't giving any stuff that I don't need. I stored a lot of crap in here. Wow. I stored a lot of crap in here. There's got to be something of interest. Uh, not seeing much. A lot of alchemy ingredients, but not seeing anything worth selling. I guess I can get rid of these. Get rid of my poisons. And I'm gonna keep water breathing because I just kind of help in some situations. And uh, anything else? Uh, gotta be something. It's a bunch of crap. Why do I have so much crap in here? Uh, party boots, one mask. I am your sword and your lead the way. Okay, we had the slow walk of shame to get through. This will probably be the last thing I did, just some of my crap. In fact, looking at the ton, it may need to do some of this off screen. I'm basically just gonna sell like all the gems and all the crap that I don't need just to clear up my inventory because when I get back to streaming this game next week I'm gonna be working on doing all the quests and uh Marth Marthal. So uh we are essentially almost done here. We accomplished what I wanted to get through. I'm just basically hoping I can get another achievement out of the way. So if you are unaware, there is a glitch where you can sell your items to any shopkeeper, even if they sell, even if they run out of money, there's a really cheap trick you can do. And I'm going to be doing that cheap trick. Take a good look around. 